All right, sports enthusiasts, before we dive into the epic showdown between the Wofford Terriers and the Furman Paladins, I'm going to need you to slam dunk that like button, alley-oop the subscribe, and throw a Hail Mary into the comments like you're aiming for the end zone. Because folks, this SoCon Slugfest is about to go down in Greenville, and it's shaping up to be the kind of game that'll have you spilling your nachos in excitement. So picture this, both teams are sitting pretty with a 15 to 13 record. It's like they're long lost twins separated at birth only to reunite in a basketball version of the parent trap, but with more dribbling and less Lindsay Lohan. The Paladins playing on their home turf are the Vegas sweethearts with a 7.5 point advantage. But hold your horses. Those Wofford Terriers are not here to roll over and play dead. They're here to fight with a win probability that screams, hey, don't forget about us. JP Peggy's of the Paladins is dropping points like it's hot, aiming to recover from a heartbreaker against the Bulldogs. Meanwhile, Wofford's dynamic duo, Corey Tripp and Dylan Bailey, are ready to crash Furman's party, boasting stats that say, we might just steal your lunch money in the game. Predictions are all in Furman's favor, with a closing act forecasted at a nail-biting 77.8 to 76. But folks, this is college basketball, where the script flips faster than a pancake at a Sunday brunch. My bet's on Furman to snag the win, but I'm expecting Wofford to give them a run for their money that'll have fans chewing their nails down to the quick. So, whether you bleed paladin purple or terrier gold, strap in for a clash that promises drama, heart, and maybe a miracle or two. Don't forget, in the SoCon, it ain't over till the final buzzer. May the hoops be ever in your favor. And remember, in the world of college basketball, expect the unexpected.